everybody, and happy Tuesday. We got a little clearing in the sky. Oh, man, that was the brutal. The smoke last from last Woo! night has gone away. Hopefully, hopefully, it doesn't return, but I think it's supposed to. Um, so, we've been talking about all sorts of stuff lately. Our last yeah. one was pretty popular. We, we, get, we brought some great stats. We're going to do the same thing today. We're going to strip away the housing and go to where it all starts in the land. What's your quote, Grant? It's not my quote. I wish it was my quote. <laughs> it's a Mark Twain quote. A little bit bigger deal than you had. <laughs> Mark Twain once said, and if you're following our social media, we actually had this on our social media, it, he said, invest in land, they're not making it anymore. But that's a little trickier nowadays in Central Oregon. We yeah. went back and looked at the stats for residential lots in the Bend area. We did under 0.2 of an acre lot. So just your standard you know, neighborhood lot. The average price in the past year has been $242,500. Um, in the year prior to that, it was 170, 170, 980. Yeah, so 179. Looking at a $62,000 jump, which equates to a, you know about a 33, 34% bump, just in the value of the land. And at the same time, we've seen these construction costs and materials go through the roof as well. So. You know, contributing to our inventory crunch has been the fact that a lot of projects just don't make sense anymore. When you're talking about your cost basis and then you have to pay SDCs to the city of Bend, you're going to be into a project for, you know, let's say two, what, 70 ish, 270,000 before you even put a shovel in the ground. Yeah. So when you're talking about building rental inventory, duplexes, apartment buildings, and just single family homes, even as spec homes, or as, yeah, as spec homes. It's really tough for it to pencil now, and that's obviously getting passed on to the consumer. And I think there's a lot of projects that, that haven't started because of the cost restrictions. And it, again, it starts with the land and what we've seen happen. Yeah, and I think at the same time, if we're talking out of both sides of our mouth, if you have, if you're somebody that has either deeper pockets or the ability to kind of play the long game a little bit more, that quote that Mark Twain said, you know, 150, 160 years ago is true. I mean, they aren't making it anymore. And if you invested in land 10 years ago or after the crash, you've done really well. And I still think the same can be true if you think another 10, 20 years ahead. But it's just that immediate need of the buyer that maybe wants to build that custom home or even buy that. And we, you see it trickle down to our production builders and the neighborhoods and what they're getting for homes in Bend and Redmond and all over compared to what we were seeing even just a year ago. And and when, you, when you're scratching your head over why could this home that, you know, these homes were 350 when the neighborhood started and now they're... 450 a year later or whatever, well, it goes back to the cost of the land that those developers had to get into and in order to improve it and, and get to the final product, all those costs have gone up. And, uh, and I don't see an end in sight necessarily. I don't either. No, I, they're not, again, they're not making anymore. So, you know, if we continue to have an inventory issue, um, I think those prices of the dirt is only going to go up. So anyway, hope you enjoyed this Tuesday tidbit. We'll see you next week. I think we're, we might start kind of a fun series. So oh, yeah. Look forward to it. What do they call that? A teaser? Like, That's a little definitely teaser. come back next week for a really cool series. <laughs> <laughs> All right. See, see, you. see you then. Bye. Hey, thanks so much for watching today's video. If you haven't already, make sure to follow us on Instagram and Facebook. Our handles are shown here on the screen. And you can always find our contact information or more about us on www.buysellbend.com. Thanks.